Today you're going to learn how to blur and animate text in Adobe Premiere Pro. I'll show you two different types of blur effects you can use, both Gaussian blur and directional blur. This can be done in about a minute or less, so without further ado, let's begin. Cineguac. Let's begin by going to our type tool, click on the playback window, and type out whatever you want. Let's write blur. I know, real creative. And we can just center this title by going to the graphics panel, go to edit, make sure your text is selected, and then click on the horizontal and vertical centering options. And of course, we can adjust the size if we want. Once we have our title, let's move over to the effects library and search for blur. You'll see in the video effects, blur and sharpen folder, we have a few options. Let's start with Gaussian, since I use this one most often. Just drag and drop the effect onto your title, and we can zoom in here. So with your title selected, let's move up to the effect control panel, and under the Gaussian blur settings, we can adjust the blurriness by toggling this value up and down. That looks pretty good. And if we want to animate the blur, we can set a keyframe right here at the beginning of the clip, and then move the playhead forward just a little bit, and set the blurriness to zero, which will make a new keyframe automatically. We can then right-click our keyframe and select Ease In, and then select the first keyframe and select Ease Out. When we play that all back, the title now goes from blurry to sharp, but it moves a little too quickly. So we can just space the keyframes farther apart from each other. And there you have it. Let's delete the Gaussian blur effect and replace it with the directional blur. The same method will apply, but you'll see now when we play with the blur length, it stretches out the title vertically. And if you want to change the direction of the blur, you can play around with the directional value right here. So let's make this diagonal, and with the playhead at the very start of the clip, set a keyframe for the blur length. Then let's move forward just a little bit and set the blur length to zero. Make sure you add the ease in and ease out effect to the keyframes so that the animation looks a bit smoother. And that's how you blur and animate text in Premiere. Thanks for watching this video. Hopefully you learned a thing or two. As always, these videos take a long time to put together. So show me some love, hit that subscribe button, and I will see you next time.